connected. There's so many different variabilities at when you're out there on the road is not only have you got the speed of the wind, you've got 160 other dudes that are in the way. So you try and have a conversation, but there's three dudes here and then there's a teammate there. You've got the different in weather conditions. I think the worst thing you can do is when it's raining and uh, you're trying to put an earpiece and it's just your ears full of water and you're trying to listen and you can't hear anything. In a bike race, it's, you're never really all together in one bunch. And then we've got a car that's behind us and there can be 20 teams, 21 teams in a race. So by the time that you've got your rider here, but then your team car's there, there's a very big difference between, it can be like two, three kilometers where you can't hear anything that he's saying and then your riders, they, they don't hear anything you say. I think there's it's definitely difficult and that's a very big area Area where I think that we can make a lot of improvements because even the time that I've been in, in in the professional bunch okay it's been seven years but still using exactly the same radios yet if they try to tell us that we're gonna ride the same bikes that I was on seven years ago people would, that the mechanics would laugh at you so it's interesting that, that there hasn't been too much improvement which is why it's it's really exciting that what we're hearing and, and what we're seeing with uh, the collaboration with, with Senna be careful, there's coming a motorbike from behind. Motorbike. Whoa. Hey, Rudy. You didn't tell us there was a motorbike coming up, was I hope you hear it. But I... <laughs> <laughs> You're joking with me, eh? <laughs> you, you really go for your name. No, I think definitely it's... Uh, it's pretty impressive. Yeah, the, the, I think it's a it's a really exciting yeah. piece of... The noise is really... Uh... And the other thing is you don't feel any of this. No. 